when I came with Jacques Demy, who was invited by Columbia to make a picture related to the success of Umbrellas of Cherbourg, I followed like a nice little wife, but I said, okay, I make my condition. If I don't like America, I go home. I remember that. So I went with Rosalie, and the minute I, I think I put my foot in Los Angeles, I loved it. I became in love with that strange city. And I, right away, it smelled so much cinema that I had to work. I discovered that, what I would say, the subculture. For the first time, women's studies at the university, things which were not existing in France at all. And all that freedom that they were proposing, all the peace and love business, you know, with the sign that everybody was wearing. And so my taste for discoveries and investigation, in a way, curiosity, and finding a shape for film, I think I captured something of that time. So in the same time, people wanted to meet us because we were the French New Wave representatives, in a way. And in that time, the people like Lucas Spielberg, Coppola, they hadn't started their work, and they became incredibly good and famous. But at that time, they were still, in a way, admiring us for the freedom, the changes of the new wave. So we were, I, I say, we were loved and appreciated, so we had a good time. We were invited, you know, I had a dinner at George Cooker with Jacques, and Catherine Hepburn was there, can you believe this? It was like being in another world. Danny Selznick invited us for a lunch with Mae West. She was old and totally in white, over made up, hair blonde. I mean, we couldn't believe that was the real Mae West. I thought I would touch her. And I tell you, I felt we were cultural gadget, French cultural gadget. They like to show us, you know, they exist out there. I didn't have a career. I made films, it's very different. My career is zero. You know, I had one success in my life, which was Vagabond, Saint-Ouen That's the only film that went over one million audience in France and sold everywhere in the world. The other film I loved, okay, which I love to know, but they, they don't make success. Uh, well, that they cannot reach more than a certain amount of people. All life is about borders, you know language borders, ethnic borders, etc. And in the cinema, I try to erase the borders, or make them smooth, between documentary and fiction, black and white and color, and cinema and art. That's why I had three lives, you know, as a photographer, as a filmmaker, now as a visual artist from the last 10 years. Again, trying to say, can we do something else that what we're supposed to do? So for me, it's still an adventure, you know,